so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! Jet skis are so much fun! I think this is the perfect time to watch the Blippi jet ski video! me, Blippi! And look at what's behind me! Yeah! It's a jet ski! We are going to have so much fun today riding a jet ski! Let's go! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Before we ride the jet ski, we need to get on our jet ski riding gear! <laughs> yeah! Alright, look at what I have on now! This is my wetsuit! And then I also got my jet ski key and my safety whistle. <laughs> and my life jacket. Gotta put it on. Oh, but you can't forget about the sunblock. My camera crew gave me a packet of sunblock to use. So let's put on the sunblock. Kinda tastes like mayonnaise, but it helps you from staying safe against burns from the sun. All right, here we go. Yeah, now that we got our jet ski gear on, it's time to fill up the gas tank. Whoa. Big full gas tank, but it's about to be empty. Now that the gas tank's all full, it is now time to ride the jet ski! Let's look at all of the colors. There's green, there's blue, purple, and black. inside the engine of the jet ski. Wow, we got the gas tank right here. 
and we got the battery and the intake and whoo my favorite part <clears throat> the spark plugs <laughs> and then we got the engine this is the actual motor right here and then the exhaust <laughs> Wow, what a powerful engine. I think we should ride the jet ski some more. All right, let's put on the hood. We're ready to ride. My jet ski just stopped! Now that I'm stuck, it's time to use our whistle! Yep, safety whistle, because then someone will come and save us. Wow, I love our cool Flippy Mobile! You're right, Debo! Our car does have amazing things. Hmm, I wonder, what were the first cars like? Good idea! We can go way back in time to see one of the first cars. I'm gonna need helicopter blades. Helicopter blades confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. Back in time! <laughs> the Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! We just traveled back over 100 years! I wonder whose house this is. It's mine! My name is Blippy. Yours? Hey, it's me, Blippy. Wait, are you my great grandpa? I think I am! Come here, future Blippy great grandson! <laughs> Grandpa, we're here to find out what the first cars were like. Good timing! I'm about to take my first ever automobile for a drive! Hot dog, isn't this a beaut? Really cool! So, how does it start? This crank will make sparks that help start the engine! The engine started! Yeah! It looks like your car can only fit two people. And no seatbelts? Hmm. Seatbelts keep you safe. Hot dog. Seatbelts? Okay. 
Let's go to the top of that hill. Now down we go! Oh no, Debo! Whoa! 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 Does the car have any brakes? It sure does! <laughs> that was really cool! <laughs> Hot dog! And I have the answer to my question. What were the first cars like? You had to turn a crank to start it, cars only had two seats, and you pulled a hand lever for the brakes. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Bye, great grandpa Blippi. Happy and safe driving. Did you see that? I just rode up in a police car. <gasps> Look at what's behind me. It's a police helicopter. Are you ready to learn about police helicopters today? Yeah, let's go. It's so neat! Would you like to learn the parts of the helicopter with me? Come on! Come down here! This? This is a camera and infrared system. This is where, from the helicopter, they can search and find suspects. Huh? And then up here, this is where the pilot and the co-pilot, the TFO, sit. And the landing skids. Landing skids are kind of like our feet. You can land on the ground anywhere you want. <laughs> Ooh, look down here. This, this is the PA system. This is how you communicate with the ground. Really loud speakers. Listen. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, and right here, this is a cargo compartment. Look, I'll open it up. Oh, that's where you store all the tie downs and the cover for the helicopter. And one of my favorite parts. This is called the night sun. It's basically a spotlight, so then you can point it at night and see what you're looking at. Whoa! This is an antenna. This down here is an antenna. And whew, this is an antenna. <gasps> Whoa! This is the name, the number, and letters of the helicopter. Will you read it with me? N six six eight P D. Will you do that again? N six Six, eight, P, D. Great job, come on. Ooh, this is the horizontal stabilizer fin. And look, there's a light right there. That light on the left side is red, and on the right side of the helicopter is the color green. Come on, let's go to the other side. And right here, this is the tail rotor. The tail rotor is what controls the helicopter's spin from going left, woo, and right. Whoa! So this is the rear tail rotor. I didn't tell you about the main rotor. Come on. Whoa! 
See up there? That's where the helicopter produces all of its lift from. Helicopters are so cool. Hey, this is the fuel truck. In the back here, there's a lot of fuel. And She's going to get out and hook the hose to the helicopter. Watch. Oh, she's putting on gloves. So she put on gloves so none of the chemicals in the fuel touch her bare hands. Oh, hey, there's the fuel cap. Ooh, it's getting nice and full. Now that the helicopter is full of fuel, we can take it for a spin. We're about to ride inside the helicopter. We all wore seatbelts and headsets, and they even wore helmets. I'm ready. What they're doing here is turning on the engine of the helicopter. See? See the main rotor spin? Whoa! It's spinning so fast! Whoa! And there we go! We have flew past the Griffith Observatory. Football! Who wants a football? <laughs> and you can't forget about the Dodgers Stadium. CFO asked me if I wanted to go to the beach. So without a doubt, I said yeah! It was a great time flying in the LAPD helicopter. There was no crime and everyone was safe. Wow! Look, now we're inside the helicopter. I'll tell you about what's inside the helicopter, but first, let me shut the door. Okay, now that we're all locked in, we need to buckle up. Okay, one belt around my waist. In two, one, two, over my shoulders. Whoa, look, it's like a joystick. This is the cyclic. This is what you use to operate the helicopter. And the instrument panel. Wow, like the altitude, the airspeed, the RPMs, the aviation radios, the police radios. Wow. Oh, hey, let me unbuckle to show you this. Look at this. This screen, that's where you see the camera, the FLIR. 
and this is how you operate it. Look at this controller. It's so neat. It's like a video game. <laughs> oh. And last but not least, binoculars. These are used for suspects from far away so you can see them. Wow, I can see so far. <laughs> Whoa, hey, <laughs> that's funny. Police helicopters are used to give the officers on the ground another set of eyes, also known as backup, as well as help capture the suspects. And so then all the citizens are nice and safe. Woo! Look at what it is! <laughs> this is a steam train. And today we are in Chehalis, Washington, and we are going to learn about trains. Now I'll show you all the parts of the exterior of the train. Like these down here. Whoa, look at the giant wheels. Whoa, there's so many of them. Wow. There's another one. Whoa. Oh, look at this one right here. Ooh, and look up here. Wow. That big thing up there? Yeah, that's the firebox. That's what heats up all the water and it creates steam, which is pressure. And then up there, that's the stack. And then the bell. And then the whistle. <laughs> Ooh. And back here, right there, that's the cab. That's where the operators of the train sit. <laughs> Ooh. And come back here. This is the tender. Ooh, and look over here. Those are the cars of the train. Now we're inside the cab of the train, and I'm with the engineer, and his name is Rick. Hey, Rick. Hi. Okay. And I'm over here with the fireman, and his name is Robert. Hey. Hello. <laughs> and they are going to explain some of the interior parts of the train. Hey, so what's this thing? 
This is called the Johnson bar. Oh, it makes the engine go forward. Or if I go over here, it makes it go backward. Oh, can you I try? try that? Go ahead. All right. I dare you. Okay. Whoa, that's hard. Whoa. Okay. Okay, now I'll go back. Whoa. Going back's even harder. Ugh. Whoa. <laughs> cool. All right, so we decide which direction we're going. We control our speed with the throttle like a gas pedal in a car. Ooh. So I pull that out, we'll go faster. Whoa. All right. And push it forward and then you go slower. And okay. I can shut it clear off. Okay. The other thing I do is I've got a whistle up here to warn people that we're coming at a crossing. Try that. Oh, here we go. <laughs> wow, that's cool. And then the other thing I have to do is once in a while to stop the train. This stops the train here like that. And this one is for the engine only independent of the train. And what's this down here? That's a big fire in there. We're heating water to make steam. That gives us uh, the energy to go. Oh, wait, so fire. And, and that's the fireman over here. So what's this thing? This handle, I can make the fire get bigger or smaller. Ooh. Go like that. Whoa. See? Is that <laughs> a little more orange? Yep. That's a little less orange. Whoa. That's pretty cool. And so you sit here and do all the fire stuff. And oh, yeah. is there anything else that you do? Yeah, I got to ring the bell to make sure people get out of the way if we're moving. So you pull this rope. It rings. <laughs> cool. Can I try? Yeah, go ahead. OK, here we go. Whoa, oh, that's cool. Well, thank you, gentlemen. for all the passengers to load on up so we can go for a ride. Okay, now it's my turn to ride the train. So come on, you can join with me. Whoa, ooh, look over here. Wow, this is the inside car where it's all enclosed. <laughs> that looks cool, but hey, let's go over there so then we can ride the train in the outside. Come on, oh, hello. Hey. Whoa, see, now we're outside. This is gonna be so much fun. The wheels were a-turnin' and the smoke was a-puffin'. Off we go. Wow, it's so green over here in the field. Look, whoo, here come some trees. beautiful pond right there. Oh, so much green. I don't know what type of plants those are, but they kind of look like lily pads. Okay, we were outside, but now we're inside an enclosed car. <laughs> what a beautiful ride. Choo-choo, here comes a train. Choo-choo, here comes a train. It's rolling on the tracks, gonna get there fast, yeah. Choo choo, here comes a train. I could spend all day watching you go choo choo. Oh, all across the country there are many train tracks and so many trains that roll on through. I can only imagine how much fun I'd be having 
If I was riding on the caboose That's the back of the train I'd try to count all the train cars But there are so many flying by One, two, three, four And there's even more Choo-choo, here comes a train Track's gonna get there fast, yeah Choo-choo, here comes a train I could spend all day watching you go Choo-choo Some trains are made to transport people I've been on one, how about you? Some move cargo miles and miles Some move oil or fruit Every time a train goes by I wonder what could be inside Choo-choo, here comes a train Choo-choo, here comes a train It's rolling on the tracks, gonna get there fast Choo-choo, here comes a train I could spend all day watching you go choo-choo You pull the whole train all by yourself And you only gotta say one thing Chugga 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 chugga
It's time to dominate the obstacle course. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! This is awesome! Whoa. How can you turn and zigzag so fast? I have something called four-wheel steering, so I can turn all four Whoa. wheels at once instead of just two wheels like a lot of regular trucks. <laughs> Us monster trucks are built for short, high-powered bursts of speed! I nailed that! Megan, that was amazing! And I have the answer to my question. What makes a monster truck special? Monster trucks are a special kind of truck with big tires, heavy duty suspension, and four wheel steering. Upload answer, Devo. Bye, Megan. It was so cool to ride with you. Bye, Blippi. Keep on crushing. <laughs> Look at this! This is a fire department helicopter toy! Ooh, and today, we're at the Los Angeles City Fire Department Air Operations! And let me tell you, I have a surprise for you! It's a real fire department helicopter! I am so excited to learn about fire department helicopters today with you! Are you ready? Let's go! Woo! Okay, now let's check out the inside of the fire department helicopter. Come on! We have to open up the door. Whoa, do you see in here? This, yeah, is the cab of the helicopter. Come in here. Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. First, let me show you the cockpit. Whoa, look up there. There's so many cool instruments, gadgets, radios. Whoa! <sighs> okay, for now, I'll show you the cab. Ooh, there's a lot of seats in here. See? I'm gonna go to this one. Whoa, hey! The seat has a seat belt. I'm gonna put it on. All right, buckle up. Ooh, you see? I'm in this seat, and there's another seat. There's another seat. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, and there's actually another seat in the back. Yeah, five, you're sitting on it. <laughs> That's funny. Whoa, look at this. Look at this giant backpack. There's a bunch of medical supplies in here. Whoa. This is what they take down to the ground to help people. Whoa, look at this light. Whoa, <laughs> it's the color blue and it's shining on my face. So these light, lights are really dim. So then from there you can use your MVGs, your night vision goggles and see at night so it doesn't blind you. Whoa, whoa, this is a headset. Wow, you put it on your ears and then has a microphone right here, but I have to plug it in first. Check this out. Get ready, listen. Whoa, can you hear me? <laughs> I sound funny. I'm talking through the microphone right now. Whoa, flying in a helicopter. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll, I'll show you more of that later. But for now, look at this. This, whoa, is a med deck. I can pull it out. It's nice and flat. Keeps the spine of the patient nice and flat. Okay, kind of put it back in here. Okay, there we go. Wow, it was so cool seeing the inside of the cap of the helicopter. Whoa, so many cool things. Whoa, oh, what's this? Blippi, this is our hook for our rescue hoist. Oh, a hook on the rescue, wait, wait a second. Who are you? I'm Pilot Sharif. <laughs> what do you do? Well, today I'm the hoist operator on our air ambulance at the LFD Air Operations. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, what's in your hand? This is called the pendant. It's what controls our hook. We can lower and raise it with this controller here. Whoa, this is the controller of the hoist. Wow. Can you show me all of this stuff I in sure, action? I sure can. Would you like to try our, our hot seat? This is how we rescue people who really aren't hurt on the ground. In a hot, a hot seat? I wonder what a hot seat is. Well, our hot seat oh, looks like a jacket. Go ahead and put your helmet on. Okay. And you already have safety glasses on, so yep. that works. <laughs> Look, I'm wearing a white helmet. This okay. works just like a jacket, and okay. it's a simple harness that allows us to bring you up into the helicopter safely Ooh. without falling through. Okay, so this is a harness that if I'm on the ground, you hoist down, or someone hoists down, to come save me, right? That's right, and they help you put this on just like this. Okay. And they'll connect you to the hook once you get down on the ground. Okay. They'll lower the hook down to you, and then we'll connect it. Whoa. And when you're ready, we'll bring you up. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's like I'm flying. We'll bring you all the way up to the helicopter. Okay. We'll bring you in, and then blip people will be safe. Oh, cool. My way. Well, thank you so much for showing me this. Oh, you're welcome. All right. It was nice to meet you, Blippi. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> wow, this is so much fun. <laughs> hey, wait. Hey, wait a second. Come back. I'm stuck. Hey, hello. Hey. Oh, no. you know helicopters are at airports and also airplanes are at airports and if there's ever a problem at an airport they have a big truck called a foam truck oh hey look there's a foam truck right over there do you see it yeah okay so what foam trucks do are they spray foam and water out the front just in case if there's ever anything at the airport like a fire. So what we're gonna do is show you it spraying water out of the turret. See, there's the first turret. Whoa, that's so powerful. Are you ready for the second turret? All right, here we go. Whoa, you see that? There's one turret and there's two turrets. Whoa, look at all the 
they can fill up the helicopter with water. Watch. Like he's ready. Wow! Look at how high they are in the air. Ooh! Where's he going? Whoa! <laughs> Look at him dangling from the helicopter. Wow! Hello! Hey! One of them is wearing the color blue. And the other is wearing the color orange. <laughs> My two favorite colors. Ooh, remember that? That's the hot seat. Okay, here he goes. Whoa! <laughs> that looks fun! Whoa, hello! just got hoisted all the way up into the sky in the helicopter. Wow. <laughs> Shut the door. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! Now it's time to learn the exterior parts of the helicopter. Wow, what a big machine. Oh, hey, up here, this is the cockpit. This is where the pilot and the co-pilot sit. So then they fly the helicopter. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> and back here, this is the cab. Yeah, this is where all the passengers sit. And this helicopter is so big that 14 people can be inside here. 14? That is so many people. Whoa. Oh, look at this. This is a spotlight. Ready? <laughs> yeah, also known as the night sun. This is used to shine so then anyone can, everyone can see everything at night. Whoa, so bright. Ooh, and back here, these, this is a water tank. And you fill it up right here. Grab the hose. <laughs> Bring on the water! Then this fills up with water, and then from there you fly over things. <laughs> and you pour water on things, like fires, so then you can save people. Wow, what a cool machine. Let's see what else there is, come on. Whoa, look down there. Wait a second. What's this doing here? Huh, you know how some helicopters have landing skids? This helicopter has wheels and tires. Wow, that is so interesting. Huh, cool. Ooh. Whoa, wait a second. You've seen this before, right? Yeah, this is a number. Yeah, one, two, three. The number three. Wow. Oh, let's open this up. Whoa. Check it out. That's a cargo compartment. It's pretty dark in there. <laughs> Come on. Oh, hey. Los Angeles Fire Department. Oh, they're pretty cool. <laughs> 
Ooh. Wow, this is a horizontal stabilizer fin. It keeps the helicopter stable. <laughs> it's so high up there! And this? It looks pretty big, but in reality, that's the smaller rotor. But this one, the main rotor? Come here! It is so big! You see it up there? Whoa! This main rotor has five blades. One, two, three, four, five! Good job! Whoa, it's so high up there! Oh, anyways, I was just trying to touch it. Whoa, look at this! The exhaust! All the exhaust from the jet engine gets pushed out of there. Wait a second. I just said jet engine. Yeah, look! Whoa! That's the jet engine. There's two of them on this helicopter. One on this side and one on the other. This is where it produces all of its power. And one of the places that it uses its power is the transmission. Whoa! That is so cool looking up there. Oh, hey! Look at this! You see right here? This is where you refuel the helicopter. We won't mess with that. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Ooh, ha -ha. check out my sweet dance moves. <laughs> okay, anyways, look at this. This is the hoist. Whoa, it goes down. Yeah, about 300 feet roughly. <laughs> that is so much and then it can save people by going <laughs> Thanks so much for learning about the exterior parts of the helicopter with me. It's time for the firefighting helicopter song. It can fight forest fires from the sky. It can stop those flames from getting too high. It can save the trees. Save your home, it can even save your life. It's a firefighting helicopter, fighting fires from above the ground. A firefighting helicopter, on a mission to put those fires There's out. Lots of water when it flies, lakes and rivers are its water supply.
look at what it is! It's a bulldozer! Are you ready to learn about bulldozers with me? Yeah! Let's go! It's time to operate the bulldozer! Whoa! Come on! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Not so fast! Before we operate the bulldozer, we need our safety equipment! Whoa! Look! I have my hard hat on! Yeah! And my safety vest! Ooh! Orange and yellow! Now we're ready! Come on! like a vacuum from the 1600s Ugh. and it's in our way so I think we should bulldoze the vacuum Are you ready to learn about the parts of the bulldozer with me? Yeah! Let's go! Let's go to the front! Whoa! Wow! This right here is the blade! And the blade is used to push anything and everything out of its way! <laughs> Whoa! Do you see up there? Those are the sweeps. And when the blade pushes large trees out of its way, if the tree falls down, it won't hit the driver in the cab. Oh, the cab! Oh, whoa! Up there is the cab. Yeah. That's where the driver and the operator sits. That's so cool. Whoa, and look, look at these. Wow, these are the tracks. Whoa, the tracks are really useful for going over mud, dirt, rocks, debris, anything, and it won't even get stuck. Oh, and look at this compartment. Whoa, this compartment, yeah is full of the hydraulics. It powers the blade, the tracks, and the scratchy mabobs. Oh, come here! I love the scratchy mabobs. Yeah, these, also known as the ripper, yeah. rips up anything and everything on the ground. So it makes it nice and soft for the bulldozer. And another compartment. Whoa. This compartment is the electrical compartment. And it has two batteries because this machine is so big. Oh, and I almost forgot the engine. Come over here. Wow, that engine is so massive. 
in this machine is so cool. <laughs> I was just doing the dozer dance. Will you do the dozer dance with me? Yeah, I'll teach you. Okay, first you raise up your hands and your arms and act like you have a bulldozer blade, like this, okay? And then you move your feet like the bulldozer tracks. So it looks like this. Good job! Okay, I have a really fun game. We'll do the dozer dance when we hear the music, but when you don't hear music and it stops, you need to freeze. Yeah! Okay, are you ready? Okay. Listen. Hold your arms out, march in place. Left foot, right foot, keep the pace. Move your arms up and down. Crouch and crouch down to the ground. Turn your hands. Bulldozer dance, stand up tall, on two feet, from side to side, bounce to the beat. Raise your left knee, raise your right, raise your arms and raise them high. Bulldozer. Bulldozer dance. We are inside the bulldozer. Before we operate the bulldozer, we need, yep, our seat belt on. Okay, let's buckle that in. Okay, there we go. Oh, and look at this. Wow, this is the instrument cluster. See, the lights, the windshield wipers, and the key. And once you turn it on, then from there, the bulldozer has power! And right here, this joystick, whoa, whoa! When you push forward, it goes forward, backward, you reverse, left, and go right! Wow! And this joystick over here, whoa! This operates the blade. So, left, right, down, and up! <gasps> Ooh! And this, operates the ripper. Wow. <laughs> Whoa. 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 What I'm doing here is bulldozing down some old dead trees. So then, it'll make some room so we can plant some new ones. Yeah! Did you see that? Yeah! I love bulldozers! Those 
cars are such amazing pieces of machinery. Now it's time for the bulldozer song. Bulldozer, clearing the land. Whoa. Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand. Whoa. Bulldozer, constructing the roads. Whoa. Move over, it's about to roll. It's a yellow tracked machine. Whoa. Found on mines, farms, and factories. Whoa. It can push most anything. Whoa. Bulldozer stirring up debris. Bulldozers help the farmers work by breaking up rocks and digging in the dirt with the blade on the front and the claw on the back. It can help you build a home just like that. Whoa, it's on a roll. Bulldozer. And they can move through some rough terrain. They can move all kinds of things. Bulldozer, clearing the land Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand Bulldozer, constructing the roads Move over, it's about to roll Bulldozer, clearing the land Bulldozer, pushing rubble and sand Bulldozer, constructing the roads Move over, it's about to roll Bulldozer, you better move over. Here comes the bulldozer. Machine. Roll, roll on, bulldozer. You better move over. Here comes the bulldozer. Machine. Woohoo! Woohoo! That was so much fun learning about bulldozers with you. Well, you gotta keep on keeping on. Life's a garden. Dig it. You just got to make it work for you. So, anywho, if you want to watch more of my videos, you know what to do, right? Yeah, just search for my name. B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. All right. See you later. What's making that sound? Oh, it's a race car. It's going so fast. You're right, the Blippi Mobile could never go that fast. Hmm, I wonder, why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? Good idea, Debo! We can go to the racetrack and find out! I'm gonna need race car tires! Race car tires confirmed. Activate Blippi Station! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Hi! Are you here to try out the racetrack? Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We're actually here to find out why race cars are so much faster than regular cars. Hi, I'm Ricardo. Let me show you on the track. Let's race. All right. Before we race, I have a really important job for you, Debo. I need you to be the captain of the pit stop. During the race, I'll pull in here so you can keep me in tip-top shape. Can you help out and do that job? <laughs> nice try, Debo. But what you'll be doing is gassing up my tank and swapping out my tires. Okay, race time! Helmets on and buckle up! Whoa! I'm going really fast! Whoa! I'm not even going as fast as I can! Only 180 miles per hour now! Race cars are made out of a lighter material than regular cars, plus my shape helps me race easier into the wind. It's called aerodynamics. You and my Blippi Mobile are definitely different shapes. Pit stop, Captain, do your thing. You can do it, Debo. 
Ricardo, do you have special tires? I do! My tires are wider and softer than regular car tires, so I can go even faster on this super hot track. Thanks, Debo. Now you're even faster! My powerful engine is five times stronger than a regular car's. I can reach my top speed of 220 miles per hour. See you at the finish line, Blippi! Whoa! I'm blown away! But now I have the answer to my question. Why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? It's because race cars are aerodynamic and made out of a lighter material, have special tires to race on the hot track, and a super powerful race car engine! Huh? Upload answer, Debo. Bye-bye, <laughs> Ricardo! Bye, Blippi! Bye, Debo! Ciao! Look at what it is! This is a motorcycle! And today, you and I are gonna learn about motorcycles! Woo! <laughs> This motorcycle is so magnificent. Do you want to know why I like motorcycles? Because they have two wheels and tires. Whoa. One, two. Let's look at the front one. Wow. <laughs> look at it spin. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Let's go to the back wheel and tire. Whoa, look at this back wheel and tire. Wow, look at it spin. Wait a second. Do you see what I see? Yeah, it's a person. Let's go meet him, come on. Hello. Hey there. <laughs> What's your name? Hunter Yoder. What's Ooh. yours? Ooh, my name's Blippi. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Ooh, is this your motorcycle? Yep, it sure is. Whoa, what do you do with it? I get to practice on these cool tracks and uh, get to race all around the country. Whoa, you get to race motorcycles? Yep. So that means you're really fast? Yeah. Whoa, will you teach me how to ride motorcycles? Sure, Blippi. Awesome. All right, meet you out on the track. See ya. Did you hear that? Hunter Yoder is gonna teach me how to ride motorcycles. I am so excited. Let's go. All right, I am so excited to ride. But first, before we ride, we need to inspect the motorcycle. Come on. Whoa. As you know, this is the front wheel and tire. Whoa. <laughs> and it's connected to the front suspension which then gives when you go over big bumps and rocks. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> and look down here. This is the front brake, and that is the disc that the brake crunches to stop. Wow, ooh, and the front fender, so then you don't get mud and stuff in your face when you're riding. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> ooh, and look at this. This is the gas tank. This is where you put in all of the gas. Hello. <laughs> all right, let's close that back up. All right, nice and snug. Ooh, and look down here. Whoa, this is the engine of the motorcycle. Wow, it looks so powerful. Hey, we should turn on the motorcycle. All right, okay, check this out. This is the start button. It's kind of like the key in a car, but you have no key. You just push the button. Listen. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa, do you, do you hear that? A lot of the sound of the motorcycle comes from the muffler, and the muffler is where all of the exhaust comes from. Whoa. <laughs> all right, come here. This 
is the throttle. When you turn this, this is what provides all the power to the engine because fuel goes into the engine. Listen. Whoa, so loud! Let's turn it off for now. All right, and look, this, that throttle, and this over here, these are the hand grips. This is where you steer the motorcycle from. And then you have your front brake right here. Yeah, that's what I showed you earlier, the front brake. This is how you control it. Ooh, 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 ooh. You just pull it in, and then the clutch. <laughs> yep, ooh. Yeah, let's see what else there is back here. Oh, hey! Foot pegs! This is where you rest your feet. And right next to this right foot peg, there is the rear brake. See? You push it with your foot, just like in a car. Wow! Ooh, and back here, this is the rear suspension right in there. It's kind of hard to see. Looks like a spring. <laughs> Ooh, and check this out. This is the rear wheel and tire. Ooh, and do you see these knobs? Oh, look. These little knobs right here, these, this, this is called the tread of the tire. It goes in the dirt and grabs everything in its path so then it doesn't slip and slide. Whoa! All right, now let's go ride. Woohoo! Now that we inspected the motorcycle, it's time to ride. Vroom, vroom, vroom! <laughs> let's go! Oh, yeah! What a beautiful day it is to ride. Got the sun shining, the wind in my face. Yeah, I'm ready. Huh, wait a second. Am I forgetting something? Oh, how could I have forgotten? The safety equipment. All right, let's put the kickstand down. Whoa, yeah! Wow, I almost forgot the safety equipment! Whoa! Woo! Check me out! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! I have my helmet on, which keeps my head safe. Ooh, and look! My goggles, which keep my eyes safe while riding! Ring, ring, ring! <laughs> Ooh! My sweet top. Yeah, it's a nice orange shirt! Ooh! and some nice gloves to keep my hands safe. Ooh, my pants. Yep, gotta wear pants while riding. And my boots. Yeah. All right, now we're ready to ride. Motorcycles. Whoa! Hey! Will you check this out with me? Yeah, let's check out the colors. Okay, so first, as you can see, I am wearing the color orange! Woohoo! And I have a little bit of blue. See? But let's check out the motorcycle. Come here. Whoa! This motorcycle has the color red on it. Whoa! <laughs> it's so pretty! And it has the color white on it. And black. 
Ooh, and do you see another color? It's really shiny. Yeah, it's silver. Whoa, silver kind of looks like gray. Whoa, all right. <laughs> Let's continue to ride the motorcycle. This is my Honda CRF 150R. It has a cool engine package and tuned up suspension that's set up just for me so I can race around the whole country and go super fast on the tracks. And uh, this is all done by Factory Connection Amsoil Honda. And today I am riding a CRF 230F. It's pretty rad. I love it. All right, Hunter, are you ready to race? Yes, Flippy. All right, here we go. Start your engine. Riding dirt bikes is a fun sport because you can do it with your parents, your siblings, your cousins, anybody. And you can choose to ride in the desert where it's open and free, or you could come to a track like this and race against other people and see who will come out on top. part about riding motorcycles is not falling. <laughs> motorcycles whoa see this motorcycle it's really big whoa and this motorcycle is really small <laughs> the great thing about motorcycles is even someone like you can ride it let's go I really enjoyed learning about motorcycles with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Let's spell my name together. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi! Good job. See you again. Bye-bye. <gasps> Hey!
It's me, Flippy. And today, I'm at the Skyline Marina in Anacortes, Washington. And marinas are where boats live. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna learn about boats. <gasps> Look, there's one right here. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. I'm steering the boat. Whoa, this is so much fun. All right, I'm gonna pull back the throttle. This is the throttle. This is what you use to determine if you go forward or backward. And this is the steering wheel. You knew that. Whoa, whoa. What else is around here? Oh, hey, I wonder what this button does. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> That's the horn. Let's do it again. <laughs> That's so much fun. Ooh, and what's this? This is a radio. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? This is Blippi. <laughs> Radios are used to be able to talk to the people on the land and other boats. Ooh, and a navigation system? This is electronic, and this one is not. This is actually a compass. It tells you which direction you're heading. Wow, that's so useful. Ooh, and there's so many gauges and instruments. Hey, and a muffin. Let's try some. Hmm, hmm, <laughs> hmm. So tasty. All right, check this out. Here we go. Let's go forward. Whoa. Whoa, yeah. Check out the back. Yeah, look. are amazing pieces of machinery. <gasps> hey, when you're in a boat, and if you are 12 years or younger, then you need a life jacket. So, let's open up this compartment and take out a life jacket. And this life jacket is the color orange. Okay, let me put it on. Life jackets are really good to keep you safe. They keep you afloat if you go in the water. Let me turn this around, go to the back. Perfect, make it nice and snug. How do I look? <laughs> Whoa, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Another piece of equipment that boats have on them is a life ring, and that's used to throw it off so then the person that's in the water oh, can grab onto it and then you can pull them in. Here, I'll go get the life ring. Whoa, check it out. This is a life ring. Whoa, I wonder why they call it a life ring. Hey, I know, because it saves lives and it's the shape of a ring. Hey, so let me take it, get it situated, and I'm gonna act like there's someone out there that needs help. So I'm gonna take the end of it. Okay, I found it. And from there, I'm gonna chuck it out there really far. Three, two, one. Yeah! Did you see that? And then once they grab it, then you can reel them in like this. Okay, grab on tight. I'll pull you in. <laughs> Like we saved someone. There we go. 
<laughs> Good job! a boat and it's out of the water see normally the water is up to here <laughs> but it's out of the water hey and check this out over here come here oh and do you see down there those are the propellers wow they spin around and push the water back to create thrust for the boat to go forward! Whoa! Hey! And look way up there! There's some buoys! Whoa! They're kind of like pillows and balloons so then the boat doesn't hit the dock and get hurt! Wow! This power boat is really cool! It has big engines to provide a lot of power to the boat! Whoa! Look at this boat! This boat is a catamaran. Check it out. Wow. Kind of looks hollow in the center. That's silly. And then kind of like a deck in the middle. Whoa. And how it gets power is from the wind. And then it blows on the sail and then it goes. Whoa. Hey, look. Here's another type of boat. And this boat, yeah, it's a power boat. But what it's used for is fishing. Wow, I see a lot of fishing pole holders up there. I bet they go fishing for salmon, tuna, crab, and all of those tasty food. Whoa, this boat is really big. Look how big it is. Whoa! look so small hey. next to it and this boat looks so big wow sailboats get all of their power from their sail whoa hey and what are these down here this is called a keel it keeps the boat really stable in the water so then when the wind blows the sail it doesn't fall over whoa Sailboats and boats in general look like so much fun! Whoa! 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 Look! This is a kayak! And kayaks are another type of boat! Interesting! Kayaks are powered by humans going like this with paddles! And in here, there's more kayaks. Come on. Whoa. Whoa, look over here. Here they are. Wow. This kayak is the color red. Ooh, and back here, this kayak is the color yellow. Oh, whoa. This one's hidden. But do you see this? This kayak is the color green. Kayaks are really fun because you sit in them with a life jacket on. Yeah, a life jacket. Whoa. Hey, let's try on a life jacket. Okay, take it off the hanger. Oh. <laughs> All right, so this is a life jacket. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> and life jackets are really useful when you're near and on the water in boats because they keep you afloat if you're in the water. So then you don't have to go, oh! <laughs> and sometimes 
if the water is really cold, you might wear a wetsuit. Oh, look at them back here. See, it's like their feet. And then the arms, and I think these are actually called dry suits because they actually keep you dry so then the water doesn't touch you. Oh, let's see what else is around here. Oh. Wow. Yeah, the paddles or the kayak. Whoa. Whee. <laughs> this is so much fun. Okay, I'll go back this way. Whoa. <laughs> Whee. <laughs> oh. Ah. This building is so big. Have you ever wondered where boats get stored so then they can go inside away from the weather, like the rain, the wind, and the ice? Whoa! Yeah, a building like this stores many, many boats. Hey, check it out. Doggy, <laughs> look, this dog is being nice and safe with this life jacket on. Hello, <laughs> oh, so soft, so cute, and so safe. <laughs> Whoa, what a beautiful day it's been. Oh, look, do you see what I see? Wow, yeah, sea life. Whoa, let's get a little closer and say hello. Hey. Hey, how are you? Wow, that's a seal. It's just laying out in the sun. Feels so good. <laughs> I'm gonna go a little bit closer. Hey, how are you? Wow, it's so cute. Look at its big black eyes. Hey! <laughs> Hello! I wonder what its name is. We should name it. I have an idea. Let's name it Seely. <laughs> hey, Seely! <laughs> All right, Seely. Have a good day. Bye bye! <laughs> Oh, I love the marina. Woo! Look at how big this boat is. Wow. Jeez, it's so long. Oh, hey, it's so big it even has windows inside. Hello. <laughs> That's silly. Whoa, look how tall it is. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't I start at the back of the boat and then I'll step it out and count the steps to see how long it is. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. This boat is 16 steps in length. Good job, whoa! It is to have this muffin on this boat. 
<laughs> Let me show you around this boat. Whoa! As you saw, that was the table. Ooh, in this area is a great place to prepare some food. Check it out! A fridge! Hello, fridge! <laughs> you can keep all your food nice and cold. Ooh, in a sink? What's that doing in there? <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, what else is around here? Whoa! This boat is awesome! Check it out! Ooh, that's the captain. Hello! <laughs> He's steering the boat. And down here is the inside of the boat. Come on! Wow! This is amazing! Whoa, it looks like a stove top right here where you can cook some food. Ooh, a sink. Whoa, that's a big sink. Some paper towels, can't forget those. Ooh, a microwave. <laughs> oh, that's convenient. There's even a TV right here. Hey, that's me. <laughs> oh, in a bed. Oh. Oh, what am I doing? No time for sleeping. <laughs> Ooh, another table. I could eat tons of snacks right here. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. A fuel pump? <laughs> That's gas. And this is diesel. Hmm, interesting. Hey, I have something to show you. Come here. <laughs> Just like how cars need gas and diesel to run on land, boats also need gas or diesel. And this boat right here needs gas. So, let's take this pump right over here and let's go fill it up. Whoa, what a long hose. Hey, check it out. This is the gas cap of the boat. So let's unscrew it. Okay, be very careful. And then put it right in there and pull the trigger. Did you hear that? It's nice and full. All right, let's put the cap back on. And now it's full to the top so we can have some fun in the sun. <laughs> hanging out in the water on this boat. I sure do love boats, and it was so beautiful out there. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't we sing the Blippi Boat Song? Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. 